The park has a total area of 5.5 thousand hectares, which will contain more than 5,000 military designs, 3,000 enterprises, and the biggest museum of armored equipment in the world. And it will accommodate up to 100,000 visitors per day. The park is located 55 kilometers outside of Moscow. It can be reached by bus from the Metro Stop Park Pobjede, by train from Belarusky Railway Station, or by car by taking the 55th exit off the Minskaya Highway. The exit is made out of two large, demountable transport bridges, as used by the Russian military. Over 20,000 parking spaces in four parking lots will be available within the park. Nine kilometers of railway track have also been built to deliver military equipment from the Kubinka railway station to the park. A press center will also be available for official meetings, delegations and the press. More than 500 examples of military equipment will be on display in a special 100,000 square meter open space area. And the latest military designs will be on display for professionals in the military industrial pavilion. Meanwhile, armored vehicles will demonstrate their capabilities at the Alabina range. The Kubinka airfield will host a majestic air show with simulations of dogfights and other aerial battles, performed by the Russian Air Force's best pilots. Visitors will be able to watch the spectacle from the stands or on big screens available throughout the park. Interactive entertainment including paintball, a motocross show and reconstructions of important historical events will be available to the visitors. And the opening ceremony will see the largest Russian flag ever raised with a total area of more than 200 square meters. All this and more will demonstrate today's potential of Russia's military strength at the Army 2015 Forum.